all your school rugby all in one place. This is Next Gen 50. And welcome to Rams Rugby Club. Of course, you were expecting to watch a live match. That live match between Shiplake and Pangbourne is happening over our shoulder. Unfortunately, the conditions have defeated us. It's been the weather conditions all week. It was actually the electrical conditions because the main pitch there is beautiful as it looked. It's pretty dark. The floodlights have failed. The game's still happening. Unfortunately, the live stream isn't. Uh, and Angus, it feels like a bit of a punch in the heart after what's been a really, really exciting build-up. Oh, it's so gutting. We've done three live streams already this week and we've been talking about how this was the big one, the big Friday night to finish the week off. It's going to be huge. It's huge for the boys out there. I don't know if you can see the pitch, but it is utterly surrounded by people. It was going to be massive. It's still going to be massive for the boys, sadly. Not so massive for us, but we'll enjoy it in a bit. It's like such a shame. Uh, the atmosphere behind this is unbelievable. I'd say I'm going to estimate a thousand. Easy, yeah, easy. But behind both goals and at both touchlines, there, there are loads of people here. There's been plenty of scores. There's still a great atmosphere. Um, they're just never going to see a video of it, unfortunately. All the preparations are in place, but there will be some great still images. So if you're a fan of either of these teams, you will still get a certain experience. There is lots to look forward to, though. Um, before we have a little bit of a chat about the game, let's talk about what's happening with Next Gen 15 over the coming weeks. Yeah, we've got some big stuff coming up. So on Tuesday... It's under 18 Schools Cup quarter final, Trinity against Berkhamstead. The other three are all decided. We've got Barnard Castle already through Sherburn, who are on yesterday's live stream, already through Kirkham Grammar School at lunchtime today, went through. Good win for them against Bedford. So we're going to have that big game. Trinity against Berkhamstead. Berkhamstead by then could well be Daily Mail Trophy champions as well. They face Dulwich College tomorrow. If they win that, they win the Daily Mail Trophy. They go on two days later to that big, big quarter final, what a season it could be for them. Trinity though, seriously good. And then on Friday, we're back here at Rams Rugby, fingers crossed <laughs> for some power and some lights and a big old live stream because we've got Rams Rugby against Chinna, our first ever National League game. It's a huge, huge one. Rams Rugby right at the top of the table. We're really looking forward to it. Uh, hopefully lots more of those to come. Just fingers crossed we get some light to Yeah, so massive disappointment, but still lots and lots to look forward to. Uh, where can everyone follow all the news? Because there'll be fans of these two schools who perhaps aren't familiar with what you do and where you do it. So just tell us a bit about that. Absolutely. Next so social media channels, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, I believe. Uh, <laughs> it's not me running the TikTok account, but it's all at NextGen15. That's at NextGenXV. Website is the same. It's NextGen15, NextGenXV. And that's where everything is. There's loads and loads of stuff going on at the moment. Um, it's a big, big end to this term. It's been awesome to have it back. I mean, a year, 18 months without a single school game. And now we've got a whole term that's just been filled with it. And this is the last weekend for almost everyone. It's so special. It's just such a shame we can bring it to a great climax today. It certainly is. Uh, Next Gen 15, that's Next Gen XV across all the socials and the website. Sorry to disappoint you on this occasion, but lots of opportunities in the future to make it up to you. See you soon.